Well, I'm Jeff Sayer, Secretary of Commerce for the State of Idaho, and I can tell you that what is happening in Coeur d'Alene and Northern Idaho when it comes to the future frontiers opportunities is unbelievable. There are educators, there are business leaders, there are community leaders coming together, and they're doing some amazing things. And this is the place where it's gonna happen. And they have our highest endorsement and our highest salute for what they're doing. I like to think about a researcher as somebody who tries something that most people say is nonsense. And what it means is you have to have confidence in nonsense if you're gonna have a research breakthrough. The most powerful question any organization can ask itself is simply, what if? And I've never quite been able to figure out why they get so scared of asking the what if question. Because that is the question that leads to the breakthrough. These people are world class and the things they're working on are revolutionary. So I'm excited to share what they're doing with you. I want you to stretch your mind. Just make sure that you, you're here and you're opening up your mind to be stretched beyond what you think might be the norm. Uh, have ridiculous amounts of fun. Uh, if you came here thinking this is just a very stuffy, traditional event, it's not. We view this kind of as a big family. We're here to communicate, have fun, create change together. I'm just gonna fire hose you with a bunch of stuff that I'm seeing and that'll set the context for the rest of the day, I think. It's a real privilege for me to be able to come to the Think Big Festival and meet so many of you who are working on so much cool technology that is out there. The chance for us to work as a community to think about all the cool tech that's coming down, I think is very powerful. If the answer is, well, that can never happen here, you've identified a market somebody else is about to break through and exploit. I love hearing, well, that can never happen here, because that means it's a huge business opportunity for somebody that has vision. What we're seeing now in an age of, of you know, constant connectivity and, and uh, you know, massive communication, we're seeing, suddenly the public is sort of seeing into, uh, into the research world in a way that they've never seen before. Technology is now, and it needs to be treated as now, and it needs to be built for what's right for the user's experience with that technology. This just shows a little bit of how, how incredible the opportunity is in Idaho for us to continue to use the state for testing, for experimentation, for innovation. And up here in North Idaho, where we're becoming the center of excellence for robotics and innovation and AI. We have potential. The young children will change our world if we own them. Get some strategy on how do we tie education, inspiration, uh, commercialization all together in the space of technology and startups. And while we're dedicating our lives to cleaning the ocean, really immerse the, the live feed aspect into the actual product. So yes, we're cleaning, and at the same time we're uploading information. We have the Robo Experience Day in Riverstone. So it's virtual reality headsets, getting in the hard brick uh, cars, see all the LiDAR, radar, Tesla car rides, robots, 3D printers, all that fun stuff. 